everyone, I'm at the New Camp Factory here in Sugar Creek, Ohio. I'm currently standing outside in their lot with all of their finished campers and I have to say this is pretty cool. Today I wanted to take you through some of the new 2019 models. As you may have noticed with most of my tours, I don't go into a lot of the details about the specifications of the campers because honestly, I don't want to listen to myself talk for 30 minutes. So what I'm going to do is give you a general feature overview along with the floor plans and the different options you have. That way you can find out what the best camper for you is. So without further ado, let's go inside and check out the new 2019 tag. Here we are in the new camp factory on their production line. We're about to take a look at a fresh off the press 2019 tag. I'm going to go through the differences between the base model, the XL model, the Boondock Lite, and the Boondock Edge. Let's start on the inside where the features are pretty standard across the board. Come on. Pretty roomy, huh? Now the biggest difference you'll notice is that the standard model is five feet wide while the XL is six feet wide. This not only gives you an extra foot in the width of your bed, but it also gives you more storage in your cabinets and shelves. Extra storage bonus. One thing you'll notice when comparing different teardrops is how spacious they feel on the inside. And I have to say, the Tag is one of the tallest teardrops there is. I mean, I'm pretty short, but I know tall people are gonna appreciate this headroom. I really love all the improvements to the headboard. First, you're gonna see we've got two power outlets. On one side, we have a 12 volt with built-in USB chargers, and on the other side, we've got 110 outlets. They also improve the storage on the headboard by putting in sliding doors makes it so much easier to access anything you want in there. There's two LED reading lights, which are really great on efficiency, and you can go blue or white. And a headboard wouldn't be complete without accent lighting and cup holders. One of my favorite things about the tag is the skylight. It's perfect for laying in bed at night and looking up at the stars. The shade system it comes with is also really nice. You can open the window and it comes with a bug screen that pulls down from one side and a sunshade that pulls up from the other. The same screen and shade system can be found on the two side windows as well. Taking a look at the ceiling, we've got our two interior lights. We've got two speakers, which are pretty much surround sound in a space like this. There's also controls for the lights. And finally, a fantastic fan for ventilation. Down at the foot of the bed, every unit comes standard with an entertainment system that plays DVDs and has Bluetooth connectivity for streaming from your phone. You're gonna have a cabinet on each side of the teardrop. You've got a TV in every unit, which now comes with what I like to call the Mandy cabinet. Lots of storage behind the TV. An air conditioner unit your other cabinet, you've got easy access to your fuse box right here, and finally another 110 outlet. And finally, let's take a look under this bed. Underneath each side of the bed, you're going to have two hinged doors accessing storage. One of my favorite options is the Foley system. Now my first teardrop didn't have this, but I later had New Camp add it and it made a world of difference. The Foley system is a plastic spring that they put under the mattress it may not look like much, but it makes it feel like you're sleeping on a cloud. Now that we've seen the inside, let's head back to the kitchen. As you can see, we've got an outdoor kitchen, which can be pretty awesome, especially if the weather's nice and you wanna cook outside. The kitchen comes with all the amenities you need. A sink with an 11 gallon fresh water tank, a two burner propane stove, a two-way refrigerator that runs off battery or shore power, a microwave in the XL version. There are cabinets with plenty of storage, as well as built-in shelves and even outdoor power outlets. And finally, we've got a light for those times when you might be cooking after dark. Now, some of you might be worried about having an outdoor kitchen, but I can tell you when Kendrick and I lived in our tag, we loved it. It makes cooking a much more social event. Plus, isn't being outside while you're camping anyway? And if you're worried about rain, a 10 by 10 awning fits perfect over this area. As you can see, there aren't a lot of differences between the standard and the XL aside from the width. But what if you want to go with the Boondock package? You have two options, the Boondock Lite and the Boondock Edge. 
The main feature of the Boondock Lite is the wheel and axle package. You're gonna get rugged off-road 15-inch tires as well as a pitched axle, plus you get electric brakes. The Lite package will also come with diamond-plated fenders rather than the standard ones, which not only are useful, but also look pretty cool. You're also gonna get the more rugged diamond-plated LP cover where your propane and your battery are gonna go. And you also get this really sturdy platform. On the left and right, you can store any extra supplies you might have, and this middle part is designed specifically to hold a 2000 watt generator. Perfect. Last but not least, you want to roll in style, and they've included a much more rugged and sturdy handle, which also has the beautiful Boondock logo on it. If the Boondock light isn't enough for you, the Boondock Edge offers even more features. The Boondock Edge comes with everything I've already talked about, but it also comes with a Yakima roof rack and a Yakima awning that pulls out 10 feet from the camper. In addition to the boondock handle, it's also gonna come with a sturdy step to help you get in and out of the camper. And on the inside of the front door, it comes with this cargo net for storage. And finally, the edge is gonna come with some really handy LED lights. The first one is this light bar here in the kitchen. It makes cooking at night really easy and it doesn't shine in your eyes. There's also two lights up front, which makes hooking up and unhooking your trailer a breeze in the dark. The tag was my first camper and I lived in it for a year, so it's always gonna hold a special place in my heart. Hopefully this video will help you decide if it's the camper for you. Love and light.